I'm back. What's up everyone, welcome back to another jailbreak video. Today's video guys, we are gonna be showing you the best grinding vehicles inside of Roblox Jailbreak. And before we begin guys, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And it's important to join my Discord server because I've hosted a giveaway for 70 Robux. So one of you guys will win it and good luck. But we gotta hit 60 members on my server, so that's when the giveaway starts. And yeah, let's begin. Also, you guys should know that the vehicles in here are gonna be ranked from low tier to the highest tier by pricing. And yeah, let's begin right now. Okay guys, not the first and cheapest car you can grind with is the Model 3. The Model 3 is the best car for starters. You can find it in the second, uh, you know, uh, street safe. It only costs 15k and I don't recommend buying it from the... Uh, street safe since it's a gamble and it only costs uh, the vehicle itself only costs sixty thousand dollars also guys if you want to find this car it's right behind the bank and as you can see it's right here that's why guys this thing is quiet its engine is quiet it really has a good top speed of 150 miles per hour good acceleration good handling and braking and everything like that it works almost instantly just like this see it's really good and this vehicle is also thanked by so many people, so you should definitely try to get it as your very first vehicle for grinding. Once you guys improve over time and get money, and now you're looking for an upgrade, right? So definitely take this car. This car is the Shell Mark V. It only costs like $92,000, but it's most people guys go for this Lamborghini, which is 100k, which is completely a bad decision. This Shell Mark V has a better top speed than the Lamborghini. A better acceleration, better everything. This this thing is more cheaper than the Lamborghini by $8,000. However, guys, unlike the Shell Mark V, the Lamborghini only stops at 175 miles per hour. So that's its only top speed. And as you can see guys here, the Shamar Cry can go up to 185 miles per hour, possibly can go 190 or even 200 if you're going downhill or you're going on a very straight road, unlike this here guys, they probably should expand this a bit and make it longer. The third car guys I recommend using is the Roadster. The Roadster guys is a very very good car. The fact that it's an electric car, it really can go very very quickly because of its acceleration and the top speed can reach up to 215 miles per hour, which is not a lot for some of you guys, but trust me, the acceleration and handling is the best. Now the third vehicle in the cars we have on the list is the Volt Bike. The Volt Bike is pretty much like the Roadster, but it has better acceleration, better, uh, better top speed, no. No, 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 they have the same top speed. However, guys, this car costs one million dollars, which is pretty ironic due to, due to the fact that it cannot pitch maneuver any vehicle because it's obviously an overpowered bike. But I think, guys, the Volt bike is mostly going to be useful for the criminal team if you want fast grinding, power plant runs. If you are a good driver and want to do the power plant, this vehicle can get you like uh, six thousand. If you turn in the money of the uranium, you know that thing. Next up, guys, and the final car is the concept. The concept, guys, is known to be the most expensive car in the whole game, but it's not expensive for nothing. Combine everything top speed, acceleration, launch, but not handling. And you get this beauty. Okay guys, now this thing accelerates really quick and it can reach 300 and something miles per hour. And it has like uh, some effect when you're accelerating with it or going, you know, reverse speed. But uh, when you get this car here and just grind with it until you are bored, you finish the game right now. What should you do now? Also guys, the concept has another feature besides its accessibility, which is 2.5 million, which is worth it. The concept is a really good car for trading, you can get some limited cars using it if you're a good trader. And now I'm just gonna say that uh, once you get your limited vehicle, go grind with the vehicle and get more concepts over time, so you get more 
valuable limited cars. And this is it guys, those are the best vehicles or cars for grinding and I hope you the best luck on your cool grinding journey. Just like how you can be cool by liking and subscribing to this channel and also joining my discord server if you want a free 70 robux. The discord server link will be of course in the description and I will see you guys in the next video. Stay cool, bye bye! Woo!